a marketplace there they called upload the files for future preservation. Users can access the FFL platform to search for content by inputting keywords or any other parameters. Once they locate the files they are interested in, they can select a file to use online either uh, throw, um, viewing, listening, reading or downloading it uh, depending on the content type. In some cases some of the files are usually for sale and the user will be required to purchase uh, it using FFL tokens. Users can also upload their files to the library and uh, before publication our community members will be have to wait uh, for the content in terms of how useful and clean it is. The file is then uh, indexed using AL tools and sent uh, to the P2P network's uh, desktop uh, clients where it is uh, stored and served to other users. If a file is intended for sale, the user can add uh, the price for file before or after uploading the file. Furthermore, a user can sort the file contents by adding them metadata such as keywords, tags, descriptions, links or marking the content as illegal or copyrighted. If the data added by the user is similar to what other users add, the user will receive a FFL token. If the system detects that the user is constantly inputting data that is different, the user will be punished with a FFL token withdrawal or ban from the platform. Copyrighted content on the FFL platform is sent to the unassigned after copyrighted category where their rightful owners can claim the file and add a price to them or request their removal from the platform. FFL will eliminate the illegal issues in file sharing trough, implementation of advanced technologies such as AL and uh, cooperating with uh, content creators. Additionally, FFL will ensure compliance with law uh, regarding content creators and owner by establishing uh, libraries in EU, USA and many more regions. FFL will create a modern and digital file library based on blockchain technology, which will be ideal for storing, accessing and tagging files for users all around the world. This will enable the platform preserve digital files for future use. FFL will not have any restrictions to sharing bulk files and will not require the users to pay for download traffic or any other maintenance costs. And for more detailed information 